We're here today at Isa Wine and Chocolate Bar on Carmine Street, a little discovery that I found on my way to 7th Avenue South. We're going to go inside and we're going to meet with Leah Williams, who is the wine director here, and she's going to introduce us to three amazing wines. We're looking forward to it. Come with us. You see this very delicious, perfect wine for this very hot day, yes. and I'm just dying to know what it is. So this is the Griot. It is a delicious white wine from uh, Sicily. Now, the grape that is used is also used to make Marsala wine. It's a medium-bodied wine, it's delicious, it's very refreshing. Um, I'm going to pour a little for both of us. I always suggest that you smell your wine before you taste it. So, is this a wine that maybe tastes better with food? Yes. So, why, okay, so I, obviously there are some wines that are wonderful alone, very inviting, and there are those right. that really come to full fruition with when food. When you have um, something with acidity, yeah. the more acidity, the more, the better it's going to go with some food. It's thin sliced smoked salmon with a dill vinaigrette. And I see some up. capers. Yeah, there's mm -hmm. capers, cucumbers, tomatoes, and a little bit of mixed greens. So I always uh, tell my wine classes that if you're eating something that you would squeeze lemon on, Right. Have something to drink that has that acidity. You're absolutely right. And isn't it amazing how the wine changes? It almost it, tastes it, completely different. I it well it, it almost becomes a smoother, more uh -huh. buttery essence to the and wine. You don't taste that acid in the the back acidity is almost gone. Um, we have uh, another wine here, so I'm yeah. looking forward to this one. This is a Pinot Gris mm -hmm. from Oregon. A lot of people think the Pinot Gris it should just be light. They're not all light. This is from Oregon, and you'll taste it. It's a medium-bodied wine. And, and to our fans, this is actually vegan as well. Yes. So organic and vegan, organic very important. and vegan. Which wow. A lot of oh, wow, look at this color. Look at the color. Oh, it's so nice. A lot of fruit. A lot of fruit, very low acidity on this very wine. Very low acidity, which is... It has kind of a silkier tone texture to it, right? And so our grilled chicken paillard, and it's served with... Um, Spinach, grilled ramps, turnips, and fresh peas. Very light, very clean, simple. All seasonal. Local farmers? Yes. That's we great. Like, we try to use as much local produce as, as possible. For Cabernet, I think that this is a little on the lighter side. I, I do see that in just the, in the, the look. Yep, in the color and right. even in the body of it. But um, <laughs> it does remind me very much of what I expect when I see like chocolate. I mean, you know, your mouth right. kind of waters. waters right. Yeah. On what that note, for an eye that is wine and chocolate. I mean, it makes you happy. There's definitely. Um, it definitely does make you happy. Make you and for ladies, this is a perfect end to your meal. You know. Is this a hint? Is, yeah, this is the hint for the guys too. Like, if you want to end your perfect day, wine and chocolate. Okay, so this is the red wine infused. Yes. I'm just gonna sit here forever. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, Cheers to a definite Midido favorite, Isaac.